Okay, so this is a mini pro motor, a 9 volt mini pro motor, and I want to show you it has a noise. By the way, someone uh, tried to change one of the connectors, never mind. But it has a noise, and I will show you what is the cause and how to fix it. So if I'm rotating, if you listen carefully. Something like this. So first of all, you need to be careful not to ruin all the wires, which already someone took apart the, the protection rubber. I will add something because otherwise when I am uh, opening it and this assembly so the, the wire can uh, be cut it because I will show you later you need to apply a lot of force to remove the starter from the water because the, the, the module magnet holds them very strongly together and you need to apply a, a lot of power in order to, to remove it so first let's protect the wires now let's see how to open it first we have the screws here uh, need to, to put it like this we have the screws that protect the cover and then we get to other screws that we can remove and then we will be able to to, to open and uh, separate the water from the starter by the way because there is a lot of force it's a good thing to protect your hands with gloves with very strong gloves uh, in the other part because otherwise you can get pretty uh, uh, hard impact uh, to your fingers and to your hand and uh, not very recommended so let's see how to do it okay so first thing just unscrew these uh, four screws need to find the So, continuing to remove the top cover of the motor. After doing this, you can rotate the top cover you will need a flat screwdriver just apply it below from So this is the inside of the motor and now I already see the problem of this noise. I will show you this is a very simple case. It doesn't happen a lot but from time to time there is this part that tore off. So when the motor is rotating so uh, it is catching the wire below and because it tore up so this is the noise I have in this case okay 
sometimes uh, there are different sinks by the way the motor is a very in a very good condition because we don't see any corrosion and we don't see water that sometimes enter to this part and you see a lot of corrosion so the motor overall situation is good and the noise is just this rubber when you rotate it and will show you I can't show but this part here is is doing noise with these parts here so this is the reason in this case now eventually I don't have to open it I, I can just cut it or, or try to to pull it okay I pull it out this is the best way uh, it's a good thing maybe to to remove you can remove the stator on from the motor with a lot of force uh, you need uh, to do it very uh, take care of yourself because you can harm the force between the nemodium magnet here and uh, the rotor is very a uh, very strong force okay so use a soft clothes in order to protect the wires below something like this and now what I'm doing I'm applying a lot of force and then you need to do it with gloves not like I'm doing it right now so a lot of force from both sides and then catch it and remove it and then you are good to go okay now we'll try to search for the noise problem so now let's put again the strip to catch all the wires like it was I guess Should be something like this. Of course, let's cut it. There is a bearing here that it changed. It was, a, I don't think it should be like this. I think, I think this is maybe part of the noise. Trying to fix it. This is 
this of course in order to make uh, the two parts slip and not have a lot of uh, contention okay let's try to close everything back is very dangerous so avoid contacting everything and do it fast again Of your hands when doing it. Something like this. Okay. Now let's close everything. No, no, it's now. Okay, looks like the problem is solved now. Let's close everything and we check. Let's see now. No noise. Totally quiet. This is the way it should be. Okay, so this was all about the stripping. That's all. Hope you enjoy.